What's up guys and welcome back to another match day video. Today it is the first Papa John's Trophy game of the season. It's Swindon Town versus Arsenal under 21s. And we did play Arsenal under 21s was back in 2021. We beat them 2-1. We did go 1-0 up. They equalised and then it was an own goal from Arsenal and we did win that one. So hopefully we do win again tonight. Could potentially go to penalties depending on if we draw. So obviously, if you win, you get three points. If you lose, you get zero points. But if we draw, we go to penalties. If we win, we get two points. If we lose the penalty shootout, we get one. So could we could potentially get penalty shootouts tonight. So for my prediction tonight, let's spice it up a little because I've never seen a penalty shootout at the counter ground in my life. That's probably the same for most uh, Swindon fans. So my, for my prediction today, I'm going to say it's a one or uh, going to be a one or draw. I want it to go to penalties. Let's face it, our penalty shootouts have never been the best, especially against recently Peterborough. I'm going to go for a 1-0 draw and Arsenal win 3-1 on pens. So, we'll get some more predictions when we get to the current ground. We'll see you when we get there. Come on, you Reds. So, guys, here we are at the current ground. 10 minutes till kick-off. Come on, you Reds. So, I forgot to say as well earlier today, Swinning announced a sign in the Fluis Ward. He has returned after nearly two seasons of not being at the club. So, yeah, the good news. Welcome back. And he's also, so, um, he's also starting as well today, so it's good to see him. So it's our first game of the Papa John's Trophy. What's your prediction? 2-1 What about you, Tills? 3-1 uh, 3-1. Right, what's your prediction? 2-0. Two. Two There you go, Lewis Ward, number 44. Here we go then, the Papa John's Trophy group stages have started. Come on, Swindon. Oh. Oh, it's outside. They scored us offside there. Go on this way, Clint. Go on! Go on! Shoot! Oh! Yes! It's no goal! But all of that from Jacob Wakelin! What a run! There you go. An early goal. Great start. Okay. It's Wakelin. Oh. That's a goal. One up. Ten minutes gone. Go on. Oh, save. That was offside anyway, but great header and a great save. There you go. Go on, Ward. Oh, it's going around him. What a block! Yes! Oh my god. That could have easily been 2-1 there. But a great block. Oh, go on! Yes! Massive goalkeeper error there. And it's Tariq Uakwe with his first goal at the club. Which should be blown. There you go. And that's half time. So far, so good against the Young Gunners. It's 2-1. So guys, half time, 2-1 Swindon. It's looking really good for us so far. Obviously, Arsenal conceded two very poor goals that you should never concede. So, um, yeah, they gifted us two goals. Obviously, they uh, had a great header, great goal. But yeah, looking good, 2-1. So, what's your thoughts on the app? Oh yeah, it's a goalkeeper in itself and I would imagine that being an absolute 
they'll be in your head for weeks if that happened to me, but um, yeah. So what's your prediction for the second half, Shay? Well, one, fair enough. Well, what I saw in the first half, my prediction for the second half, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say 3-1 to Swindon. So, we're gonna go into the second half. I hope you enjoy. Here we go then. Let's see what the second half has in store for us. Yes, Ward. He could go all the way here. Go on, he could go all the way here. Oh, what a run! Oh no, they're well in. It's a two on one. They should be scoring this. Oh no. Oh. That's in. To Wolf. It looks like we'll be going to penalties if it stays the same. Oh. Hey! You can't be missing those. And that's it! 90 minutes could decide the game. So penalties. Frankie, penalties should be prediction. What's your prediction? 2-1. 2-1, what about you, Shane? 4-2 Swindon. 4-2. I'm sticking to my prediction. I reckon it'll be 3-1 Arsenal. Our penalty shoot hasn't never been the best, but come on! Lewis Ward. Lewis Ward is class in saving penalties. And he's shown that. Saving penalties against Man City, Paul Vale, Forest Green, the lot. So let's hope he can do the job today. Here we go, like I said before, most people have never seen a penalty shoot out at the counter grounds. But now they've got the chance. Here's Jake Kane on the spot. Hi, Jake Kane. Harry, Harry, Harry. Yes! yes! Come on, Jake Kane. Make it four. No, we can't. It's a save. Wards. Wow. So here we go then. Final penalty for Swindon. As it stands. Brooklyn Genesini. If he misses, it's all over. And we walk away with one point. Yes! If Arsenal score, they win. It's over. Arsenal under 21 to get two points for Swindon with one. So guys, full time Swindon two, Arsenal under 21 two, and we lost five four on penalties. It is devastating, but it's only the Papa John's trophy. And if it weren't for those blocks off the line in the game, we uh, block, we got the ball blocked off the line three times. We could have easily been battered that game. We're easily gifted with those goals. The first one was a known goal. Second one was a massive mistake from the goalkeeper. So if it weren't for them, we could have easily lost 3-4, four, four, maybe even 5-0. So um, yeah, that's my opinion anyway. Comment down below your thoughts on that game. So if you did love what you watched today, make sure to get down and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And I'll see you on Saturday.
So, uh, yeah, have a great night. Not so chill.